Hello world, lock picking dev. Today I have an American lock, an old brass US set American lock. I'm not sure of the model of these. These are completely dead core and that's making it pretty dang difficult for me to pick. So um, wish me luck. Let's see if we can get it open. Pen four. Nothing on five, five, it's a little bit more on four maybe. Yep, there we go. Click on five, three, click on one, click on two, Four. We're almost there. I feel like I overset five there. Yep. There we go. Click on two. One. There's our open. Whew. Boy, that thing is a pain in the butt to pick. Be really gentle with it and really feel it out there. Yeah, here's an old brass US set American lock. Let me see if I can find the key here real quick. Oh, here we are. The bidding is actually not bad. I, the fourth penny gets these really high, but all those lows I freaking hate. And so all those lows and that fourth pen being high makes it a little bit more difficult. And of course that dead core. And I don't think I have two of these. Otherwise I would say I might gut it, but yeah, I'm not gonna do that. It's kind of, yeah, nice old brass American lock. Anyways, we are at Dead Horse State Park. Let me stand up without dying. Oh, here we go. And this is in Utah. Some of you in the States might recognize it. It's an iconic little river bend right here. But yeah, that was our brass US American lock in Dead Horse State Park. These things, man, if you get one of these, uh, have fun with it. This is honestly, out of all the American locks, this has been probably the hardest one for me to pick. Just because that dead core, like this complete dead core. All right, everyone.
Thanks for watching.